I'm here because I've had a lot of heartbreak in my life. First at 19 and then sort of famously at 21 and then even more famously at 25. From what we have seen, Adele has always kept her relationships private. The only relationship she made official was the one with her ex-husband, Simon Konecki. What's different this time is that she was quick in showing off her new boyfriend to the world. Hello everyone, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we'll talk about how Adele finally made her relationship official with her new boyfriend. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. The Hello singer took to Instagram to introduce her new boyfriend Rich Paul to her fans so they could say hello to him too. She posted a few photos the old school way with a simple red heart for a caption. Well, did the news really come off as a surprise to everyone? We don't think so. Didn't we all kind of know that something was brewing between these two? Adele posted photos from a wedding she and her boyfriend attended. It was the third photo, which had her and her boyfriend Paul that made a buzz around the internet. From from the photo dump, she was seen wearing a Scaparelli haute couture by Daniel Roseberry. The off-shoulder outfit was gorgeous with sleeves that looked like heavenly clouds. Paul was wearing a stylish tuxedo in the photo. Adele resorted to an elegant hairstyle where she had her hair partitioned. She completed her look with big gold pearl earrings. Overall, the two of them in the picture looked adorable. They did look happy as a couple in the Lakers' power forward Anthony Davis's wedding. He also is a client of Paul. The other famous faces seen at the wedding were LeBron James and Russell Westbrook. Wife Nina Westbrook shared a fun photo booth click that had a glimpse of Adele. If you don't know who Paul is, Here's a little intro about him. Paul is an American sports agent based in Ohio. He has an agency of his own by the name Clutch Sports Group. It was started in 2012 and now he is one of the top agents. He represents famous sports stars with the likes of Ben Simmons and LeBron James. And that's about it. Now let's get back to their relationship. We can trace Adele's dating history with Rich Paul back to two months. That was when they made an appearance together during the NBA season. On July 17, Adele was seen alongside Paul cheering for her favorite team at the NBA Finals. It was the game where the Phoenix Suns were defeated by the Milwaukee Bucks. Soon, the news was buzzing in everyone's phone and it was said by sources that the relationship was not that serious but they were having an awesome time together. If you think the NBA game was the only time the media caught them together, wait till you hear about the other dates the couple had. They have been spotted a couple of times dining in New York streets and Los Angeles. On July 24, Rich Paul and Adele were caught by the paparazzi while they were on a date at Cipriani, one of New York's must-visit restaurants. Earlier in August, the two were seen at the 35th birthday celebration of Savannah James, wife of LeBron James. They were seen rapping and shaking a leg to WAP, the billboard hit of the singer Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion. We know that a lot of Adele's songs are inspired by her ex-boyfriends and heartbreaks. There was a man that inspired Adele's all-time hits like Rolling in the Deep, Someone Like You, and Set Fire to the Rains from the famous album 21. Adele was so in love with this man that she said she would have given up on friends and career to be a part of his life. Fans call this mysterious man Mr. 21. It is rumored that Mr. 21 is none other than her photographer Alex Turok, who was there with her for the entire An Evening with Adele tour. Her debut album, 19, was inspired by her anonymous first love. She said she dumped him via text after he cheated on her. The famous song Daydreamer was about a friend she was in love with. He happened to be bisexual and left with her gay friend just four hours after confessing he felt the same way for her at her 18th birthday party. Through her songs, she has sung stories of her heartbreak and the challenges of love, but this time, we hope if and when she releases a song inspired by Paul, it would be a happy one with butterflies and rainbows. Well, that's it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. What do you guys think of their budding romance? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. Also, subscribe to our channel to get notified when we come back with more and more intriguing content. Until then, stay safe and stay healthy. Bye!